we're at the Kanara Falls uh, Trailhead, and as you can see right here, it's sold out. We got our tickets about, I don't know, two weeks ago. So definitely get your tickets early because it sells out. And again, we're out here in October. So I know it packs up a lot during the summertime, but even off season, it's sold out. So get your tickets early. Well, the first part of this hike right here, you can see is kind of a slog. It's a little, uh, if you were here in the summer, this would be super duper hot. So we'll see how it progresses, but you're right in the full sun. All right, if you really have to go to the bathroom, go here. This is the last stop before you get down to the actual trailhead. That's your first water crossing right there. Um, of course, you're not allowed to go pee or poo because this is the uh, town watershed. All right, we finally got off onto a different kind of uh, trail. I'll show you the other side of it, but um, still full sun. So about a mile and a half in and uh, finally the shade of these trees and the mountain provides a little bit of relief. So we just came to the junction right here. You can either go down and across, but since we want to stay in the shade, we're going to stay on the shady side, but we're now hiking up the river area. There's a nice trout just hanging out. We're getting wet now. Melissa's about ready to. And then it opens up to this. Wow, so beautiful. So in this part, you're basically staying in the stream or you're going up. There are some uh, spots that you can go way up high, but the higher you go, the harder it is to get down. And I think that's mostly when uh, the water is really high, like if you're coming during a uh, floody season. You could probably hike everywhere, but there's a lot of little alternate places to go up if you uh, start getting your feet, start getting a little chilled, but I'm sure you can walk up the river a lot of the way. So I don't know if you can see these, but there's a whole bunch of butterflies up here. So here's the entrance going in. Look at that just like the Narrows. Super cool. By the way, the water is 47 degrees. That's almost uh, ice cube temperature. All the melting glaciers. <laughs> Melissa said, all the melting glaciers. kind of funny because we could totally walk in that river, but almost everybody's walking along the edge because it's so cold. Okay, we're coming up to the second ladder. And uh, so you gotta get wet up to your calves in this portion. Super pretty up here. Nice to feel the sun on my shoulders.
Thanks for watching. There she goes. Join our journey. We know you have questions and comments. The Adventure Travelers.